Hello everyone, welcome to Hyperender S3 tutorial. In this video, I will introduce the fundamental of the software to get you started Hyperender S3. First, let's go through the interface. On the top line is our menu bar and toolbar. In the center of our screen is stage area. This is a place where we can show all the resource playing from either timeline menu or program menu. On the left side is the resource center. We can add several kinds of media resource, include image, video, audio, text, PowerPoint slide, capture card, NDI network display, timer, effects. Just a drag resource we want to edit to either timeline or program tab to edit and play it. We can also add aux timeline at the bottom of the resource tab. Click on plus icon to add an aux timeline. Double click on aux timeline that we just generated to add that next to the main timeline tab. More detailed information, please check our following videos. Next, we will introduce the timeline management tab. As we said in resource tab, just drag the resource to add it in timeline window. We will see that a timeline window with selected image appears in the stage area. We can edit its property in the bottom right. Also, we can set director command for the medium in the timeline tab to control it. Let's talk about the program management tab. We can add different type of layer, include window layer, timeline layer, output layer, effect layer, label layer, into a current list. We can also add new program by clicking on the icon at the top right corner. Like what we did in timeline management tab, just drag the medium into any window and program that you want to play. To switch program, click on play next program, or click on play for a specific program. We can set the properties for different window at the bottom right. At top right is the playing status tab. We can control all the media playing in timeline or program window. We can set sync type and timing display mode at the bottom. Let's go back to stage area. Since we have already added many media inside, we need to add display screen to output them. Click on add display on the top to choose the screen that you want to add. Drag the screen to the place that you want to display. Then click on connect on the top and open display at the bottom. The media that we see in the display frame will show on our screen. Press Ctrl plus Alt plus C to exit. Finally, if you want to save and share the project, click on File, Pack Project, choose a target folder, and give a pack name. All media means all the media that we added into the resource management tab. Use the media means the media that we use for this project. In this time, we will choose Use the Media and Copy. We can see that a folder has been generated on the desktop. This is the project pack. This is a brief introduction for HiRender S3. We will introduce more functions and tips for further use. So please check our website for more details and information. See you next video.